It has come to our attention that a mysterious force is loose. The mysteries of creation are there. Up in the sky? Up in the sky. It's not an easy skill to learn. I've been practicing it for many years. So what is going on everyone, it's your favorite ninja, SetsBK1 from Ninja Nation Gaming, and I'm here bringing you a very easy upgrade guide for the new zombies map, Ancient Evil. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to upgrade the Fallen Hand of Gaia into the Redeemed Hand of Gaia, very fast and very easy. I hope this guide helps you all out, make sure to drop a like on the video, and if you're new, Hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications by clicking the bell right next to it so you never miss out on any more awesome guides and live streams. Now without further ado, let's get into the video. First things first, what you want to do first is open up the amphitheater and activate the sentinel artifact. So make some points, kill some zombies, get over there, activate it. Once you have that done, you want to start looking for dormant hands. You will find these laying around the map in these glowing pots, sort of like the Dead of the Night crystals. Once you find a dormant hand, pick it up, and you can take these hands to any ritual of your choosing. But in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the Fallen Hand of Gaia, and then upgrade it to the Redeemed Hand of Gaia. So, once you have the hand, you want to take it over by the Zeus perk located by the Spartan Monument, and place it on its little shrine. Now you must stay in the glowing circle and defend yourself for 30 seconds. Once that is complete, you'll now get the Fallen Hand of Gaia. Now you can start the upgrade process right away. First what you want to do is go to the intersection of treasuries and you will notice a plant with three crystals making noise. Shoot all three crystals with the gauntlet and the crystals should disappear, the plant as well. You should see a seedling after it disappears. You have to pick it up. Now warning, you will not have a gun in your hand once you pick up the seedling. So go right back to the Gaia's shrine and plant it. Now the next area you want to go to is the Stoa of the Athenians. And you will see another plant that is making noise. Shoot the three crystals like you did before and take the seedling back to the Gaia Shrine and plant it. Now head over to the Temple Terrace and do the same thing. Shoot the three crystals, take the seedling back to the Gaia Shrine. Once you plant the third seedling, a portal will open up in front of the Gaia Shrine. You need to press square to enter it, and it will take you outside the map to a sort of like a challenge area. This is where you will use the Redeemed Hand of Gaia for the first time and she requires you to pass a test. You need to use its special abilities by holding down the shoot button and using charged shots. Once you have killed enough zombies, it will then open another portal and you will be automatically teleported back to the map, wielding the redeemed hand of Gaia. And then you're all finished, upgrade complete, simple, quick, easy. Now you can go have fun killing zombies with its special abilities. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, be sure to drop a like or Fortnite might actually make a comeback. I'm Seth BK1, aka Richard J. Tater, and I'm out. Peace.